Hi, this is Chuck with Simply Nuck, and I've got a great new product to show you today. This is currently on the website for uh, pre-orders. It is called Sequoia, and it is the first of a new series of Long Life Models, or LLM, from Simply Nuck. And LLM indicates that it will have a minimum of five years availability. In most cases, it should be at least seven years, and uh, perhaps as long as 10 years. So for those who have been wanting uh, a mini PC that had a long life, uh, a long availability, the Sequoia will meet your needs. It is also high temp, and this will go from zero to 60 C, and you can go into the BIOS and set your operating temperature uh, for what operations you'd like, so that it balances the performance of the processor with cooling uh, for the environment that you wanna run it in. Now this one is also, the first AMD Ryzen-based mini PC from Simply Nook. So we've got long life, we have extended temperature range, and we have the first AMD product, AMD Ryzen. Now this one is the AMD Ryzen V1807B, and so the model is called the V8. And uh, this is operating at 35 watts, and then we also have a V1605B, which is referred to as the V6 model, which is a 15 watt. And so now you can go for performance or you can go for power savings if you don't need the power and uh, save on the cost. Let's take a look at the features. So being that this is targeted for industrial, as many of the connectors and switches as possible are mounted on one side. So we'll see that it's heavily front loaded. So we have the power switch and then we have a four pin power connector. Now this power connector is the same power connector that's found on the Intel nooks inside on the commercial motherboards. So if you were to get the older Maple Canyon or the newer Dawson Canyon or Chaco Canyon, this is the same four pin connector that you find on those boards. Now the pin out of this is two grounds, one power and one ignition input so that you can uh, select for it to power down when the the key is turned off on your car and to power up automatically with the key. It is also a locking connector. And so you don't have to worry about, uh, you'll see that many of the connectors are locking so that you can operate this environments where there's motion without worrying about the connectors or cables vibrating off. This is also what we call an automotive grade uh, wide voltage supply range. And this is from eight volts to 32 volts. So this allows you to power directly from uh, automotive uh, or vehicle power supplies. And with this wide uh, range that you can uh, power it uh, with uh, in environments where you may have your own power. As such, we offer this with a 90 watt power adapter or with just a power cable that plugs in here and has, uh, I think it's two meters of wires for you to screw into a terminal strip. We have two Intel server class gigabit ethernet ports. We have two USB 3.1 Gen 1 ports. We have two MDP ports, and you can see that there's screw holes above them. We actually have special cables that plug in here and the cable screws in so that the connector doesn't come out. There is an RS-232 port, and there is an RS-232 or RS-485 port selectable. You can see there's a power on LED and a drive activity LED. So that covers the front. Oh, one last thing is this little green tree here, evergreen tree, is a indication of the long life products from Simply Nook. So we expect to, to put this tree on any product that has a minimum of five years of availability. Taking a look at the other side, we have a micro SD card slot. We have a second, or a third actually, a USB 3.1 Gen 1 port. On production, there will be a slot here for a SIM card for your LTE modem. This one has the optional wireless AC radio plus Bluetooth mounted. And so there's two RPSMA type coax connectors for your antennas uh, for the wireless AC and uh, Bluetooth radio. And then there's additional punch outs here for the LTE, GNSS or GPS radios. The other punch outs are for other options which don't exist on this model. 
Right, taking a look at the site, we have the air in, inlets. You can see they're very large area. Now, this is a prototype, the production. We're changing what the uh, pattern of the metal looks like. But with that change, you'll still have these two screw holes in the middle. And you'll see that that's the same on the other side. And then it's also the same on the bottom. What these two holes are for is for the DIN mount or the visa mount. So this allows you to mount the either of the two sides in both orientations or the bottom, uh, either to a DIN rail or to a visa plate. Here's the air inlet. This is a, a blower version. And so this is the 35 watt V1807G, or sorry, yes. And uh, you can see the uh, labeling. This is made for Simply Nook, our UK office, so it has our UK address. Long life model. Uh, this is the first generation. It is the V8 processor in the Sequoia family. We have a barcoded serial number and the two MAC addresses are barcoded as well. So that's it. This is Sequoia. It is the first of the long life models of computers made specifically for Simply Nook. And that this one is uh, 0 to 60 degrees C, 8 volt to 32 volt operation with multiple locking connectors. So this is really good for uh, industrial applications or applications where you're going to have kind of harsh environments. So thank you very much. And I hope that uh, you take a look at this product. It's going to be very high performance and it's going to be a product that uh, we haven't been able to offer before for high temps or long availability. So thank you very much. Have a good day.